Stop giving EA their money. Go buy coins over at AOEAH.com. 3% off of Coach K. All right, YouTube, Matt Kennedy here. Right now, we're going over some updates for Madden NFL 25 Ultimate Team. First things first, Michael Vick is an LTD today. We're going to go over his price here in a minute. But right now, there is an LTD opportunity pack. Also, we have a Season of Boom card here. We could pull an 85, 86. Let's see if we do it. And 80 is not really bad. Joan Dotson, however, not going to make the team. Okay, free train though. Not going to complain. So the thing I'll say, uh, we also have enough for 180 for Campus Heroes. Why not? Have some fun. Go for a full master here, 86. Why not? Why not? Why not? And no. All right. So anyway, the thing I'll say is we're going to go over to, uh, we're, we're already max level two, by the way. Uh, daily goals here. Why not get it done? But the thing I'll say is that we are max level. We are getting a 4,000, not bad. We are getting a new season in only about three days. So I'm pretty sure it's on Tuesday. We're going to confirm it here in a minute. Um, we're over 100K, which is nice. Here's who I bought today, by the way, for Legend Saturday and whatever. Um, Clay Matthews for 260. The reason why is because he actually has really good pass rush stats. Um, definitely a budget beast, Lawrence Taylor. Only like one or two less speed than LT, honestly. Um, LT is obviously better, but is LT worth four times the coins? Probably not. Uh, Quay Walker for that 85 speed, linebacker speed uh, with decent stats. Haloti Nata for 250 for the run game is crazy. 340 pounds. He sheds like crazy. Him and uh, Bran uh, Br is it Brandon Fishk. Okay. So the thing I'll say as well is that Tim Tebow has been pretty good. Here is my NMS team update for you guys. McCaffrey is for free. Tim Tebow for free. A lot of these guys for free. Uh, we are going to sell Armstead pretty much tomorrow because I think Monday, Tuesday, they're going to roll out those rookie premieres for us. Um, the make rights, they said by Tuesday, but maybe Monday or Tuesday, right? Definitely going to sell Njoku as well for this upcoming week um, and stuff like that. We did pull Brian Thomas, BND from the maxed out field pass campus heroes. Also, the right guard is for free from the campus, uh, from the Mutt Champ 16 wins. Defense looks way better now with Quay Walker, Quay Matthews, and Nata. Uh, not to mention J.C. Horn from Friday night last night. Um, overall, our team is really solid. Not to mention Greg the Leg, who has good power as well for a rental coin quick sell. So my next step as an 83 overall team is to definitely go ahead and probably sell Njoku and downgrade that tight end and use those coins for other stuff. Uh, but be careful because, you know, like I said, guys, I mean, Saturday you should always buy some of these legend cards because if I check right now for my two investments here, uh, Nata, if I can find Nata, um, I bought him for about 258. He's already profit, right? Even if it's just, you know, you know, 15K, right? 15K is still 15K profit, right? Clay Mags for 260 because, you know, a lot of people got their free legend, so they just sold them off or whatever. He is 350. And I got him for 260. So that is literally going to be about a 55K profit, maybe 60K profit already. So those two, make sure you always join me on Saturday mornings for the market crash advice. I would not buy any offensive linemen because we are getting a season two free lineman, Tyler Smith. So what's going on? And we are getting some make rights, which could be an extra JC Latham for some people. So we are getting right here the 89 overall players. Cooper DeGene. We are getting um, Stephon Diggs, Kirk Cousins. We are getting, I think that's, is, is that Tyron Smith or Tyler Smith? And I'm not sure who number zero is there. Let's see who these are here. Um, we are getting 89 overall. Um, you can see Kirk Cousins only has 85 throw power. Wow. Um, so here are some of the stats. Kirk Cousins, I don't know if this is his maxed out stats. Um, maybe. Diggs, Cooper, DeGene. It's Brian Burns. Brian Burns, not sure, not sure what kind of speed he'll have, but they are they are gonna be 89 overall maxed. 
So they are 89s, the Fon Diggs and whatever. So honestly, that's pretty cool that they are 89s. So however, and two ability buckets. But the thing I'll say is they do not get all team chems. So see how Heinz Ward has the Browns chem. He does not have it right here uh, for this one. So understand that the season two cards come out next week. Next week's legends, we have Reggie Wayne, Eric Berry, pretty good safety, pretty good receiver. And then the LTD is going to be Ricky Williams and or Tony G. They keep doing tight ends because they're trying to preserve Kyle Pitts to be still exclusive in head-to-head -head ranked. That's why I'm going to sell Najoku here soon because of Tony G coming. Um, trust me, he'll be pretty good. Um, last thing really quick. Um, could be the make good. Are they going to upgrade Puka Nakoa as a make good? Interesting. So they updated his card art. That could be the, 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 the make good coming out. They could upgrade Nakoa to still have all team chems. And that would be a really good make good in my opinion. Um, game time is the ultimate kickoff promo, and we literally have Micah Parsons, CJ Stroud, Brock Bauer, Shermaine Edmonds, and stuff like that. AKAs, we have Darius Slay, we have Marshawn Lynch, and Paul Cross. Um, then we have more LTDs coming out. I want to say that's a receiver. Or no, is that Brian? Br who is that? Do you remember? I'm not sure who that is, bro. And then we have Justin Simmons, the former Bronco. I think that's actually going to be a receiver for them. Not sure. Um, MCS kickoff. Derwin James. Not sure how we're going to get him. But like I said, you know, Mutley's is a pretty good job with all that stuff. Um, my last big advice for the video ends here is just saying, dude, that gauntlet, make sure you play it. Uh, I do want to see the price of Michael Vick, though, real quick. Um, so let's go over LTD Vick here. But... The thing I'll say, guys, is that we already played the gauntlet. Tomorrow, I am going to play um, Cut. And while Legends drop tomorrow morning, I'll stream tomorrow morning as it drops. But um, So here is Michael Vick. Um, he is going for 1.7. Not really that bad, actually. Everyone thought he'd be 2, 3, or 4 mil. Honestly, we're only 6 hours in. He's already 1.7. He'll be in packs all day tomorrow, probably down to 1.5. So 1.5 for Vic, you can't really say that it was unobtainable, but still pretty expensive. And like I said, guys, season one ends in actually two days, 17 hours, which means it is going to be on Tuesday. So pretty exciting stuff. Um, which one am I going to pick first? Kirk Cousins, Stefan Diggs, you know, which season two card for an 89 overall? I mean, I don't know, bro. Like you might want to be careful as well because... You know, we just got to see how quick it is to get it, you know, whatever. But an 89 overall is pretty dang good. So we'll go from there, guys. Take care, and I'll see you guys in the next gameplay stream. Bye-bye.